Hi, it's Andy here. Um, last night for, uh, I had trouble with the pronunciation, whether it's a possessive or not a possessive, or how is the plural or not the plural or the singular. Anyway, I had cod tongues, and uh, they were very tasty, which is a delicacy. I first had, uh, I, I first had Newfoundland at Marble Mountain. Uh, uh, the, they, they, they had a potluck -like lunch, but they also had a barbecue. When I came through the finish line after the, af after, uh, the first run, um, they were. They gave me a hamburger and said, "What well, would you like on top? Would you like some cod tongues?" I went, mm, "I guess so." Uh, so I had. It was really tasty. I did it on the chairlift, boy. I did like three inspections that day. It was so. They were so good. Anyway, I came across them at the grocery store, and they're really easy to cook. But the first time I did, I checked with Roger Hardy just to make sure I had the right recipe. And I, the two ladies I was with, they, they knew the answer. Oh, I knew the answer. We all knew the answer. It's a little bit of butter, salt, and pepper. Pan fry them to a crisp, and uh, they were really good. Um, so I made them again last night, and uh, they they were really tasty. So here's how you go about making them. And and my my footage from last night was interrupted. <laughs> so so a anyway, first of all, you clean the you clean the cod tongues. They're about the size of a hamburger patty, a small hamburger patty. They're quite large. Um, and uh, first you rinse them off cold water, then you pat them dry. Then I throw them in a Ziploc bag and I put a couple of squirts of mayonnaise and I kind of dredge them in the mayonnaise. Then then I take uh, I use those little goldfish. And I put those in another Ziploc bag and I pound the crap out of them with my hammer. And then I throw those in and, um, and, uh, and then I have, uh, then I have um, goldfish coated cod tongues. And then you just pan fry them in some butter. I use a lot of butter so it's almost like a saute and they were really tasty. So I got all these pictures. Anyway, they were really good. And uh, Roger's caution the first time though, when he sent a text he said, be careful, if there's ladies around, don't eat too many. And I didn't know what he meant. And then the next text came back and said, or eat them all. <laughs> anyway, that's what uh, that's what I had for dinner last night. And, and you can have them, yeah, you know, like a lobster roll kind of, you can have them with potato chips or I had them with pub style coleslaw, which is really just creamy uh, St. Hubert coleslaw by a different name. Anyway, I hope you're having a nice day and that's how you make cod stungs.